Let's take a look at what Compressor 4.1 is. According to Apple, Compressor is Advanced Encoding Simplified. They break it down into four categories. Advanced Encoding, Industry Standard Encoding, Pristine Format Conversion, and Distributed Encoding. Compressor 4.1 now has a new intuitive interface. It's a single window layout with a darker look to match Final Cut Pro in motion. It has a dynamic preview window that shows results in real time as you prepare your footage for encoding. You can scrub through your video with frame accurate timecode controls, trim media, and instantly see how effects and filters will look when applied to your audio and video. Compressor 4.1 allows you to have customized export settings from Final Cut Pro and Motion. You can customize any settings in Compressor and then export directly to them from Final Cut Pro and Motion. Compressor 4.1 has a streamlined workflow. You can quickly execute common encoding tasks by selecting from a list of destinations like iPhone, iPad, and video websites like YouTube and Vimeo. Even easier in Compressor 4.1 is custom destinations, which allows you to combine encoding with post-encode actions such as emailing and executing scripts. You can even share your export settings with other Final Cut editors and they don't need Compressor installed. You can create your settings in Compressor and share those with other editors. Compressor 4.1 includes a variety of presets that make it easy to deliver content for Apple devices. With Compressor, you can upload files to popular video websites including YouTube, Vimeo, Facebook, and CNN iReport. You can also choose from a set of menu templates to create basic Blu-ray discs and DVDs from Compressor. You can quickly set up encoding jobs for a broad range of industry standard formats including MPEG-2, H.264, and QuickTime. You can also encode to ProRes to make video editing even easier. If you choose to encode files for HTTP live streaming, Compressor delivers all the files you need in a single web-ready folder. For DVD projects, you can also use Compressor for converting audio into Dolby Digital AC3. Compressor also allows you to add closed captioning files to MPEG and QuickTime files. You can also add metadata such as keywords, copyright information, and annotations to files as you encode them. Compressor 4.1 also supports Targa, DPX, or Cineon image sequences, and you can encode them with any compressor setting. With Compressor, you can convert any file from its source format to any other format. For example, you can convert NTSC to PAL, SD to HD, or Progressive to Interlace. Compressor also allows you to use reverse telecine to convert 29.97 frames per second to 24 frames per second. You can speed up, slow down, or adjust frame rate to make the duration match a specific runtime. Compressor produces pristine timing effects complete with automatic pitch adjustment for audio. In Compressor, you can choose from a set of convenient image filters to customize and clean up your content as you encode. You can easily add timecode overlay or animated watermarks, which are ideal for identifying your work. You can quickly fix video problems by applying color correction, noise reduction, brightness, and contrast filters without leaving Compressor. Distributed encoding is built directly into Compressor 4.1. Just install Compressor on any Mac on your network and activate it as a cluster node for distributed encoding. Encode jobs without dedicated hardware by using pre-configured groups of Macs on your network. Shared Computers sets up a cluster of encoding nodes based on the availability of designated computers. It can even tap idle process cores on a single computer using all the processing power of multi-core machines. Compressor 4.1 is available from the Mac App Store for $49.99. To purchase Compressor, launch the Mac App Store. Type Compressor in the search field. On this computer, I already have Compressor installed, so it's telling me installed. Otherwise, click the application and click the price. Type your Apple ID, username, and password, and Compressor is automatically downloaded and installed.